Hello my friends, you are watching Coldemons PL Open the Box series. I'm Lucas and today I'm going to show you some extra stuff from T-Rex. It seems to me that everyone who follows the news on the modeling market has noticed that 3D prints are becoming more and more popular. Almost everything is now printable, so it's not surprising that so many new printer products have come to modeling. Today I would like to show you a series of interesting aftermarkets from T-Rex. I chose them because of the Panther I'm going to build soon and some other German vehicles. Well, let's see how it looks like in the reality. Each product is packed in the same way. A cardboard box, a foil bag with plastic box with parts inside. Additionally an instruction. Exactly, the instruction. As all we know the manual is hmm, to be thrown away because we all know everything about the product. Right? You know what I mean. Well, it's there and it's worth reading, trust me. So here it is. This product includes 3D printed parts. We strongly recommend that you handling 3D printed parts with special care and following below steps. First. Parts are printed using photosensitive resin, the longer it exposed to light, the harder become. Please avoid putting it under direct light, prevent it from being too hard to cut or trim. Second, spray a layer of primer first, think after you open the box, we strong recommend you doing this before further processing. Third, we carefully design the support of 3D printed parts to be as small as possible you can separate the part from the base by cutting from the bottom with a fine knife and then cut the supporting tree off carefully from the parts. Fourth, for parts temporarily not in use, store them in container that can block the light. Fifth, heating can soften and deform parts. Oof, interesting, isn't it? Generally, I really like what I found in the boxes. I hope that I won't have problems with cutting of the parts. They are very soft and fragile, but I am sure that they will look great on the model. All in all, they were designed by the same man who made the Panther models for Tacom, so this already proves the quality. The modern antennas for change. They look great, but there is one doubt. The tips are so delicate that I am not sure if mounting the antenna will be easy. We'll see. And finally the icing on the cake. Trucks for Panther. Let's check them out. They look great and are ready to be assembled without any cleaning. We have two types of pins for them, so you have to remember which side of the vehicle you are preparing the trucks for. As you can see, they are easy to assemble, they are fully workable and I'm sure they will look good on the model, the same as the rest what I said before. Check the effect in a few weeks. In conclusion, I must say that I'm full of appreciation for their work and I really like the products. I highly recommend it to anyone who wants to enrich the model. That's all for today, see ya!